Lent is traditionally known as a time of conversion, and the most effective conversion is not simply what you do, but your heart. Hello, this is Father Kabicki of the Apostleship of Prayer on this first Friday of March with some thoughts on the Sacred Heart and Lent. In his teaching, Jesus made it very clear that the heart is the source of good or bad deeds. So the conversion to which we're called every year in Lent is not simply a matter of trying to change what we do, but the state of our hearts. Sin hardens the heart, closing it off to God and to neighbor. Sin closes the heart in on itself, making it think only about itself. So conversion from sin means getting a heart transplant, having God, in the words of the prophet Ezekiel chapter 36, take from our bodies our stony, hard hearts and giving us natural human hearts. When was this prophetic promise of Ezekiel fulfilled? By Jesus, when he anticipated his death on the cross at the Last Supper and said to his disciples, This is my body, take and eat. Jesus gives us his own heart in the Holy Eucharist. Change is possible because our hearts can now be changed from hearts hardened by sin to the heart of Jesus himself. As you continue your Lent, think about this. You can't change anyone else or even yourself. Only God can change you, and he does so when he gives you a new heart every time you receive the sacred heart of his Son in Holy Communion. Jesus, meek and humble of heart, make our hearts like yours. May your heart change ours.